Okay, class, and now we're going to move on. If you open your textbooks to page 5. Hey, Mr. Spence, I got a question. Yes, your question? Wait, first of all, who are you? What, you know me? Come on, we're boys. No, I don't know who you are. It says guest. Who, are, who is that? What do you mean my name's guest? You know who I am. Are you in my class? How do you not know who I am? I need you to put your name in. I need you to sign in. Well, how do I change it? We're going to talk about it. We're going to show you all how to do it. What's up, HCPS? Welcome to another edition of Wait, How Do I Do That? I'm Brad Spence again, and today we're going to talk about logging in to Microsoft Teams. A lot of people are having some frustrations, a lot of people are having difficulty, and they're coming up in their classes as guests. We can't have that. We need to know who you are, and it's great to identify yourself, so we're going to show you how to do it. And we're going to start with your Windows devices. So not Chromebooks, not your personal devices, but if you have a Windows device, we're going to start with that. So we're going to head up into the corner and go to Teams. So we go to our class, we're getting into its learning, and we're going to click on our link to go to Teams, and it's going to open up Teams for us. If you have a Windows device or a school device, not a Chromebook, but a Windows device, at this point you should be able to click Open Teams App. That's going to allow you to open it up with your credentials. You may need to sign in with your um, HCPS login credentials, which if you remember from that video, that's how you log in. Once you log in, you are in and you're good to go and it'll come up as student and your name. That's what you gotta do with a Windows device. You're good to go that way. So, on the Chromebooks or a device where you're going to enter through the web browser, this is where we need you to pay attention. We do not want to enter as a guest. Do not wanna do that. Underneath that, there is a button that says, sign in for a better experience. You click that button and it'll take you through the sign-in process just like you were using your credentials. Once you go through that process, you're now signed in as a student and your teachers can identify you and you should have more functionality with Teams. So there you go. Now you should not be coming up as guest in your Teams meetings. Now you should know how to come up as student and your name so your teachers know who you are and we're not hiding. Um, it's great. If you're still having difficulty, if you still need resources with everything, please visit hcps.org and go to HCPS Together tile. There is tons of information there, tons of ways we can help you. Please reach out to your schools and we're going to get through this. What matters is the instruction in the classroom and what matters is the teachers that love you. Have a great day. Bye.